Hey everybody out there, I'm Hoop Smiles and in this video I'm going to show you how to make a DIY face mask using a sock. Yes, all you need is a sock and a pair of scissors, okay? Some of you might be thinking, well, why am I hula hooping? I wanted to show you how easy it is to make this face mask using a sock that I can do this while hula hooping and it's gonna be super, super simple. So in terms of the sock that I recommend, I'm gonna get a little bit closer to the camera right here. I just recommend a regular uh, footy sock like this. Now, in terms of the sock itself, I do recommend that you definitely use a clean sock. Also, you don't want to use a sock that has many holes, you know, you want to make sure that it's still intact enough so that you don't have all this air that's going to go through the cloth of the sock, okay? So if you have to use a new sock, you might have to do that to get the best quality of sock mask. So super, super simple. What I ended up doing here was, I'm gonna get closer again. I ended up uh, drawing some markings. If you can see those markings there, uh, basically that's where you're gonna make your cuts with your scissors. So super, super easy. So I'm gonna start out by making the first, let me, let me make sure, I don't know if you fully saw that right there. So let's uh, look at that again. So that's where you're gonna make your cuts with your scissors right there, if you can see those markings. So I'm gonna start out by taking my scissors here and I'm gonna make the first cuts uh, just on that mark right there. And another thing too, you don't have to actually um, you know, draw on your socks because if you do, it will leave a black mark there. And then I'm gonna you know, cut those other um, black lines that I drew on my sock right here. Okay, so I'm cutting these sock out and cut these parts here. See how easy this is already? I'm actually almost done with making this, okay? And just do my last final cut. And I'm just gonna throw this on the, the ground for now. I'll pick it up later. So finish my cut here, my last cut. So like I said, I'm doing this while I'm hula hooping. Super, super easy. And there we go. I have my finished product there with the cuts. Now I'm gonna go ahead and just put my scissors on the ground. So I'm gonna get a little bit closer here so that you can see what this looks like. And now I'm gonna take this and I just go like this and now I can put it on my face like so. And look at that. I now have a face mask that is made out of a sock. And basically I can adjust this, make, making sure that it fits over my nose and it fits over my mouth. Now you wanna make sure that you use a uh, face or you want to use a sock that's going to fit snugly on your face okay because you don't want too many gaps in this sock so that uh, let's say air sneaks in there so you want to make sure that your sock really fits uh, nicely and well on your face also too what is great about a sock mask is if you want to you can take some paper towel strips and you can even try to put some paper towel inside your sock itself or uh, you can put it just uh, on the other side uh, of your sock and then put it on your face so isn't that easy that was seriously so easy and i did the entire thing while hula hooping i'm still hula hooping and i'm going to put this mask back on so to just give you an idea. Also too, the way that you put your mask on, you wanna grab it by the loops on the end, okay? I would recommend avoid touching the center spots because if you touch something and you didn't wash your hands, use hand sanitizer, you may actually contaminate your mask. But you don't need to touch the center part of your mask, just hold it by the loops like so, and then put it around your ears. And what's nice about this mask, let's see if I can give you a shot here with my ear is that what I like about this mask right here is that it fits really nicely around my ear and it doesn't really feel too harsh. Kind of like if you were to use rubber bands or if you use um, you know, hair ties to make your mask. Uh, so something that's really nice about the sock mask is I would say it fits pretty nicely around my ears and it doesn't seem like it hurts, okay? So that's uh, just some tips with your mask. But yeah, like I said, super easy sock mask. Do it yourself, uh, learn how to make a mask using a sock. Thank you everybody out there for watching. I have some more tutorials that may even get into some more details on how to uh, make this version of the sock mask, but also uh, a version using safety pins and rubber bands if you don't wanna actually make cuts in your mask. So I'll put some links 
uh, to those videos in the description of this video. But, uh, but yeah, that's how you make a sock mask like so. If you have any questions about this mask, please feel free to ask go down to the comment section of this video. Also, let me know how are you currently doing during these times? How's it going? Feel free to engage me in that conversation in the comments as well. But hey, everybody, I'm Hoop Smiles, and here's the sock mask. Thank you so much for watching. Enjoy.